Artemisa Banda runs daily malaria information sessions. As the only doctor at this clinic just outside Maputo, she tells patients how she contracted malaria while pregnant and survived it. She teaches them about prevention and early diagnosis. We share our experiences to say we have been there and we know how it feels. We tell them the symptoms include heavy bleeding and they can have complications when they go into labor. So we try to tell them our first-hand experience so they really understand this is serious. Malaria is a scourge in this country, like many others across Africa. The mosquito-borne disease is the leading cause of death in children under five. Around 40% of the population carries it in their blood. Of the more than 250 patients treated here daily, half of them will be diagnosed with malaria. It's endemic in this area, and cases increase during this time of year. Doctors say they have to remain vigilant. I would be very happy if we can eradicate malaria completely. But as you can see, we still have challenges. That's why every day we have these information sessions where we teach people how to protect themselves against malaria. Pregnant women and children under five years are a vulnerable group. So all pregnant women who attend a health facility receive one net to protect her and they receive the drugs from the 13th week. Maputo province is the final area to benefit from the government's project to provide mosquito nets nationwide. The project is funded by the Global Fund. Around 16 million nets have been distributed across all 11 provinces. These should last a family for three years. The nets are already showing results. Last year we are reporting 7.5 million of cases. If we compare with last year, we reported 7.5 million cases. This year we are at 6 million cases so far and yet we have a month left. If we compare, we can say that in Maputo and five other provinces, the cases are going down. And in three northern provinces that we started to distribute, the cases are also going down. Health officials say improved surveillance, early detection and more community health workers like Banda have led to fewer malaria-related deaths, from 2,500 in 2015 to 1,000 this year. They're hoping these nets will provide an extra layer of protection. Voldi Karolsa, CGTN, Maputo, Mozambique.